my peoples of YouTube. This is Kyla Man one here, and I hope you like my new title sequence because I worked a bit on that, and I think it turned out pretty good. So I am back here for, sorry about the little delay, I'm just working on a bunch of animations right now. I'll have them to you guys hopefully pretty soon. And I'm bringing to you today part four of my Minecraft YouTube blendery guy. And pretty much today we're going to be focusing on weight painting the guy. But before we do that, actually, no, no, yeah. So first of all, we're going to focus on adding, right now it's only the armature. And it doesn't have anything to do with the mesh. That this That's what you call this thing. So pretty much we're going to try adding this. So what you do here is uh, right click on this, go into Z for a wireframe and one on the numpad for a front view. And then you're going to just click on this. It's like the mesh, the guy. And then press shift and click on the armature and then press control P. And it will say with auto, the, this little thing will come up, set parent to with automatic weights. So once you have that, now just click on the armature again and they'll, it'll be this little thing. Also, there's uh, pose mode. So pretty much it's all in blue. And when you rotate it, see that's his arm rotating. But you will find that basically it is severely messed up when he moves his arms. So what we're going we're gonna to try fixing that. And what we're going to do that with is weight painting. So basically right now we are going to go in here. And right now you can't really see the bones. So make sure you've clicked on one of the bones. You've like right clicked on one of the bones then go up here on this little bar armature it's the little guy up here and then click x-ray check in the checkbox thing so now you can see the armature pretty much and it's still a bit messed up so now you will right click on the mesh and go over the ob object mode weight paint so right here this is the weight paint thing i just wanted to um front view and mind you i am also in uh ortho orthographic view or something but you do it like this so pretty much right now i usually press z for a more like this is more precise so pretty much now you will click select one of the arms for let actually let's start with weight paint weight paint to the head um so press g and try like press control and drag it up here and you'll notice that the green the green and blue means there's no weight on it so if there's blue then if you rotate this, notice the blue won't move, but the orange will move a lot, and the green will move a bit. So what we're going to do, the orange represents the weight, so we're going to need the weight all on the head and not on that. So first over here, oh, and if you don't have this right now, you press T for the toolbar. And see there's the brush tool, this is add and subtract, subtract, those are the only ones you need for this. Pretty straightforward. And pretty much what you want to do is just left click on those little sides so now this the top of his head is good and now you'll click on the only on the corners on this part oh just a sec and on this tool part here is um basically a radius usually around to maybe like 23 that yeah that's good and the strength all the way to 100 because you don't want to be really clicking multiple cut times so just yep okay so now oh yes but we also have to sub Extract this this stuff down here. So just click on the edges. Sometimes it's good to occasionally. I had a problem with this sometimes. It's occasionally good to like go with this. It gives you more of a view thing. But pretty much now that every the rest of his body is blue and only his head is red, that means his it can rotate a bit. But it's still a bit messed up. So basically that means that there's still a bit of weight on it in this bone. And we don't want that at all. So, yeah, we're still on subtract subtract here. So, we're just going to subtract that weight. Oh, man. Sometimes you have to put it back up to one one full weight thing. Okay. So, is it done yet? To test it out, usually you want to go to... Oh. And, yeah, see, his head doesn't move. But uh, the thing... Oh, just a sec. Sorry, I forgot to mention this. When you rotate... See, when you press R and rotate this bone... Uh, it moves this body. It's still messed up, but that's not the point. Pretty much, 
Um, in edit mode, we forgot to do something. Notice that it doesn't, it should move his arms and his head as well, like the normal person. So pretty much we're, we have to go back into edit mode right here and not in the mesh. So make sure you press tab, to, no, sorry, press object, go over there, object mode. And now make sure you have clicked on the armature and now it's back on edit mode. Pretty much right now still, it won't move anything else but this bone and that's not what we need. So click on one of these, right click on one of the bones, this arm, right, this bone right here. Then on the head bone, shift, click, shift, click. And then l make sure you click on this one last because that's the one that we're going to parent these two. Parent, so to parent it, cr press control P and it'll just make parent, keep offset. So now basically it'll move all of these three bones when it rotates. And that is what we want. So we'll put it back into pose mode, actually. And then this goes back to weight paint. And now we, we have the head. And when you rotate this, it looks better. So now we're going to do the... You usually have to start with the head and arms. So now we're going to go over to the arms. And we got to subtract this little bit of yellow here. And... Uh, yeah, that looks good. And, oh, see that? At the corner of his side right there, we gotta subtract that. Sometimes you can't really see it, but it still um, has a bit of weight on it. So now we're gonna do the same with this side. And subtract that. Oops, I subtracted a bit of that. Okay. And subtract that there. So pretty much now, just to test it out, rotate it and make sure that no other sides move. That, that looks pretty good. And pretty much when you want to have th with this, the bottom bone on the arm, you want to have it only not on, not weight on the top. So there is sometimes a bit of weight on the top. And you want it to only move the bottom of his hand. And we'll fix that little thing later. So I'm just going to do the same with the other side. And we should be good for that. So now we're going to focus on the body, the, the torso like part. I'm not really sure. But um, so now we're going to add weight to the top of it with this, the top bone and make sure there's. Yeah, that's a, that looks good. And before we do the bottom bones, it, the bottom bones and the legs, they are the most irritating. I have so much problems with this. But basically, he has like a lot of messed upness look you don't really when you, you when you wake up in the morning you don't want to see this in the mirror so basically we're gonna have to subtract this so basically zoom in and you're on this bone so you want to subtract weight from the other oops no i'm gonna add subtract so to see that yeah you usually want to i i used to not zoom in and it caused a lot of tr problems and i was like no i sucked at weight painting but now i'm good at it so, and this, we only want weight on this part, like the bottom of this, the torso, but not on the leg. So we're going to zoom, like censored penis, sorry. Uh, but, uh, okay, so now there's no weight there, except there is over there. And, okay, so now there is literally no weight on that bone, and that's what we need for now. And... We'll just add a bit of weight on the top of this. Basically, this is like the arms. Those The legs are exactly like the arms. And now, oops. Okay. So there's one leg. One leg down. And so now we're going to do the second leg. So see, there's... You're going to want to subtract. Make sure you don't click both of them. Yeah, just click one. Don't click that side because that would suck. And sometimes you got to zoom in and zoom out just to get it. Oh, it's stupid. Okay. Do I want... I wish there was just, like, some magical weight paint thing where it weight paints it for you. Except that doesn't really exist. So sometimes if that doesn't work, see, I'm just clicking on that. You just click on this bone and try to add weight. Oh, what? Sorry. Add. What? Oh. Okay. So now it is going... To hopefully add, sorry, I'm just having difficulties with this today. I don't even know why. It doesn't like me. Oh, come on. 
Okay, this is... Yes, okay. So now, that looks good. And now we're just going to do the other side, which hopefully will be quite a fair amount easier. And... Um, we'll try dragging this. Okay, that's good. Now we'll just subtract that last bit that moves around. Oh, I'm sorry. Excuse him. That is my brother. My dad's going to go tell him to, like, not do anything. And, yeah, that that's my brother. You just heard him yell, Dad! And, yeah, that's... That's my house, usually. So, yes. I'm not telling you where I live. I don't really... Okay. So, we're almost on the legs. I'm just doing the same as I did with the arms. And after this... We should be done the weight painting, and I'll have another video out to you soon. So basically, now we're just going to do a final check. So this looks good. This is what it's going to look like. This looks good. This. You. Okay. Make sure that's rotating. Oh, yeah, I'm just control z that. Pressing control z to undo that. Okay. control z And there we go. And, oh, wait, 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 yes, okay, that's why you check. And now, oh, come on, there, and there, okay. Now, it has been weight painted, so now you just grab it and press, hold down control, G, and hold down control, and, oh yeah, you're just gonna shift S, what, never mind, okay. So that looks good. Control. I don't know why my control S thing is not working today. Yeah. oh well. Doesn't really matter that much, but I'm just basically putting it back together. Nope. And here we go. So basically, now the guy is he looks a bit better. We're going to go over in the next episode. We're going to add a bit of stuff in the armature. And not in the next episode, but in the, I think it's like the, this the, the fifth episode, probably we're going to add some new bones to make the mouse, the, sorry, I called it the mouse, the mouth and the face. So, yep, that's it for now, guys. I will see you in part four, I think it is. Cat the man one out.